And the Brasley is open all the year round, has been for the last nine years, even though we're at the end of the pier, some people would associate that with being a heavily seasonal business, just open in the summer, shut in the winter. But I made a point that I wanted to open to the public in the winter, for the people living in the area, for the people moving to the area. In the winter, we're just inside, we don't have the terrace open, so we turn all the heating on, make it cosy, do some hearty food. If people envision coming to the Brasserie, there's a few things that should jump to their mind. They'd be first warmly welcomed. There's only two in the kitchen. It's not a big brigade, so it's a small menu um, with all fresh food. Yeah, just fresh, simple food, but with my personality over it, and I keep changing the menu all the time, so it's never static. Do a bit of fusion, a lot of um, mixing some Asian flavors, because I like them. The best compliment is when customers come back for me, and they come back again and again. For me, that's the ultimate compliment. The most famous person that I've cooked for is the Queen. I did that at the Turner Centre. They had their security come behind the kitchens to check there wasn't anything dangerous or untoward. The Queen couldn't have beetroot on the day in case she got it on her dress, so I had to make sure I had no beetroot on one of my starters. I always wanted to be a chef. I just found it natural. I did well at that in secondary school and won awards. Um, so then I went to college and always cooked, always had weekends jobs, washing up, cooking in the pubs. So it was ingrained from an early age. I was always, always been in the industry, no other, no other industry. So cooking just feels natural in it. And in the family, there's cooking all around me. It's what, what I'm comfortable around. Because we concentrate heavily on the fish, when we get the whole fish in and we bake it, people go for that a lot. And then make a really nice sauce because everyone can cook a piece of fish, but the sauce lifts it up and highlights it and goes that next level that can elevate a dish. And we even do desserts for the charcoal oven, pineapple char grill that's been marinated in spices and alcohol. Um, but the main challenge is always to be better than the day before and keep pushing yourself. Whilst I'm custodian of the building, of the Brasserie, I'd like to say a big thank you to the, all the people that come um, and dine with us and hopefully we can have some great times whilst I'm here. I'll do the best I can to make your experience the best. And yeah, spread the word.